to be a boatie to appreciate what an impressive sight this is. A luxury catamaran doing what it was made to do. Cruising along the broad water, off to, well, anywhere it likes. It makes you think though, like many great creations, we don't often spare a thought for how they were actually made. That's probably because its early beginnings don't look nearly as pretty as the finished product. Whilst it may end up in the Whit Sundays, it all begins here in a noisy, hot shed on the Gold Coast. I've dropped in to see Murray Owen and the guys at Marine Engineering Consultants at Gold Coast City Marina. As founder of MEC, Murray knows exactly what's involved in turning ugly ducklings like this into a work of twin hull art. Yeah, it's totally different from a sheet of aluminium that you buy off, that gets delivered off a truck to how it is now. It, it basically starts from the computer, the drawing board, it then goes to the, the, the people who do our cutting, and so it's called CAD cut, and uh, then it gets delivered to us in sheet plate and, and then we join it together and weld it up from here. How is the client involved? From the beginning? Well, definitely. We, we go to the client with a proposal and then that gets probably changed a dozen times by the time it, it then goes out to be cut. According to Murray, this is where the advantage of building boats with aluminium instead of fibreglass comes in. Nothing incurs the wrath of a boat builder more than changes halfway through construction. Fiberglass, you, you generally got a mould, and so therefore you can't really change that mould. When we're not starting with a mould, we're starting with a piece of plate and moulding it to suit. And uh, so, yeah, we can basically do anything with it. We've got one, one boat that was only going to have an open flybridge. It's now a fully enclosed wheelhouse. Another vessel that was delivered to Darwin, it was going to have um, a staircase externally. We ended up putting a full spiral staircase inside the boat and change the whole layout to suit. So we can basically do any, any custom work at all. And this is the product of 30 years experience in the super yacht industry, combined with 55 people working for 15,000 hours. A 15 metre luxury aluminium power catamaran. For Murray, while seeing one of his boats out on the water gives him a great sense of pride, it makes him even prouder to know his family helped him build it. I remember my grandfather and my father taking me fishing when I was, as long as I can remember. Yeah. And uh, they, they were both into commercial fishing as well, they both had prawn trawlers, so I was brought up around boats ever since I can remember. What are your good memories of those days? Oh, I remember wagging school a fair bit and going out in the prawn trawlers. That's and a good memory. Yeah, yeah, that was good. And like so many people with a love of boats, it then becomes your working life? It does. I then got into boat building, uh, which, as you can see, now, now my life. My, and now my three children, who I've been taking boating ever since they were babies, uh, they all work for me as well. If you can see yourself at the helm of a luxury power catamaran just like this beauty, then head in and see the Owen family and the rest of the MEC staff at Gold Coast City Marina in Coomera. Mm -hmm.